So yesterday there was an update for the DJI Flip, not for the RC2 controller, but I did notice also, I think it's DM Productions, or I think it's Darren, isn't it? He had, an, he had an update for his actual RC2, which I've just checked this morning, there's no update, so I think what's happened, DJI's pulled it. So the RC firmware I've got is the 05 000300. And I think the one that Darren updated was the 06000037. Anyway, don't want to confuse the matters. But somehow, when you're using the RC2 controller, what it's doing, it's not, it's not doing a screen save. So if you're doing a screen save, guys, normally it will go onto your SD card, not in your internal drive. Because um, I took some good footage yesterday, and one of the things that come up while I was flying this, when I put it into what I class active track, um, in, on the spotlight, it picked up Bonnie, which was interesting. Won't well, pick the car up, and so that hasn't changed. To be honest, nothing's changed on the flip. It was just fixing minor bugs, apparently. So going back to the RC2, anyway, I obviously screen saved it. When I got back, put the card in, nothing. Uh, so I put up the video last night and apparently I'm not the only one. There's quite a few people have noticed when they do the screen save, it's not on there. Anyway, what it's done, it's, it's done, it's gone back to the old way. When, when they first bought this out, what it was doing, it was um, putting it on an internal card. <laughs> now there's loads of videos out there, guys, that you can get that footage off your internal card and put it back onto your external, your SD card. Anyway. What I am going to do, I'm just going to do a quick demo because um, the other thing is I just want to make sure that it didn't keep changing backwards and forwards. So it's a pretty easy, easy process. So anyway, what you do, you go into profile. You then go down to settings. And then you go to storage. Now, Officially, that's what it's supposed to be like. So the SD card, so all, all the information that you're filming on your screen save goes onto your SD card. Now, for some reason, yesterday with the update on this, how it's done it, I don't know, but it put it back onto the internal storage. So this is what it would normally look like after yesterday. <laughs> and now what you do, you just press the SD card, do the switch. It takes a couple of seconds. So that's done. So what I am going to do, I'm going to go out later on. I've got to, there's a new update on the Litchi Pilot. Uh, now I can do my Mini 4 Pro. I can do the follow and manual mode. So now I'm not too sure with these updates on the Litchi Pilot. It might have been a test pilot. I don't know. But um, I had another email last night come through. So I'm going to check that out later on. Anyway, I will be using the RC2 control around that to see how that goes. So, fingers crossed, <laughs> it was just a glitch. Um, be interesting to see if today or tomorrow there will be a, a further update, because looking at Darren's controller, it completely messed it up. Now, some of the people had no problem. Now, that's the other problem with updates. Some people have no problems with their I don't know if it's to do where they are around the world and other people, and I'm one of them, always seem to get a problem with these updates. But thankfully, with the DJI Flip, guys, there was no problem. So don't panic about that. Um, it was just a minor glitch on the RC2. So hopefully that's been helpful to you. I'm going to pop off out later on because we've got a lovely sunny day. It's a bit windy, but who cares? Anyway, as always, there's going to be another video coming very soon.